Hey everybody, this is Brian Dunaway, and I'm about to play it poorly. Brave Land Edition. Join me as I quest on the strategy game, turn-based Brave Land. Uh, I've played the demo already of this, and decided that it was worthy of a further playthrough. So, join me now as I hop into the fantasy world that is Brave World. Brought to you by the Tortuga team. Uh, game designers, characters, all that good stuff. That's, that's a nice little character list of, of individuals who are involved. I like it. Also, I noticed that since I've uh, converted over from the survival, I'm sorry, from the demo mode, there is a survival mode now. That's very cool. I can connect to my Facebook and my Twitter, but I'm not going to do that right now. No way, man. Got my sound turned out a little bit, so, you know, you know, cuss the things. All right. Uh, love the art style. Art style is gorgeous. Look at these cute little wispy trees. Uh, way to go, 2D background guy who did his 2D art. Ekataringer burger burger. You did good. Good job. So, let's hop in here. Uh, I'm going to do a new game. I started another game, but, uh, boop, delete. I only made it like half a foot before I quit. All right. New game. Uh, new game. Easy, normal, hard. If you know me, I go for easy. No, I'm going middle. I go normal most of the time until I get familiar with the game. And uh, then I'll pick something. All right, got a little sad druid there. All right, here's a little description. You grew up in a small, far-off village where everyone lives a quiet and peaceful life. Woe came suddenly. A ferocious gang of bandits attacked your village. Having plundered your barns and killed anyone who resisted, they disappeared into the darkness. But you're not one to surrender to your fate without a fight. Wearing your father's old armor, you decided to go in pursuit of the villains. Sad druid. Sad druid. All right, this is me, apparently. I'm a happy little knight. Uh, judging by the tracks, the bandits are headed east. Let's go after them. All right, so you got your little uh, portal aperture looking thing right here. Arrow pointing towards us. I'm going to go meet this guy with the pitchfork. Uh, bandits, they're more like animals. We rarely get away. What? We rarely got away. We hid in the haystacks until they were gone. Why am I so country? I don't know. Our barns were got somebody laughing. Nice. Our barns were ro were being robbed while you were busy rolling around in the hay. Because of you, the whole village faces starvation. We didn't think of that. What should we do now? We can still catch the bandits. Follow me. The peasants join you. Achievement unlocked. First followers. Very good. All right. So let's go over here to our second aperture. So far, turn-based strategy game. Not so much. I'm just navigating through here. By the name of Gertrude, my mother, how could we forget this forest is full of giant wolves? How could you forget that? That's enough. A couple of hungry wolves is no match for us. Pitchforks at the ready. All right. Said night. All right, here's our grid here. Uh, here's my description of my, of my foe. Young wolf can handle a sheep, but won't be able to overpower a bull. No special abilities. One star. Here we are. Uh, enemy squad of one wolf is approaching. It's not really a squad if it's just one wolf, is it? I have a squad of seven peasants represented by one peon farmer dude here. So wants me to move here to this squad here. No problem. I can do that. All right, attack. I can do that. All right. No, nope. oh, he attacks back apparently. Wait a minute. There's a second wolf. I didn't even see him down there by the bushes. So a second squad of one wolf. Uh, looks like I'm handling these guys pretty good with my pitchfork. Not a problem. All right, I won. Got a little bit of experience. A little bit of cash. I did lose. I lost. I lost a, a, a peon. That's not nice. All right, that's no big deal. Uh, so that's subtracted from my trophy amount and get 16 points. Victory is mine. All right. Oh, so... Onward and upward. So, okay. That, this is me, but my peon is already in the woods waiting on me. So, I guess this is my warriors. Oh, I'm just sitting here waiting, waiting in ambush. 
Likely story, looks like he aimlessly ran in fear and ended up in the wolf forest. Nothing of the sort. I was only luring the enemies into a trap. The peasants join you. Get one peasant? Alright, that's fine. I can deal with that. So my squad of one peasant and I, we shall go to meet Robin Hood. Robin, Robin Hood! We heard rumors that your village has been robbed by bandits. Could it be true? They took everything we had in store for the winter. They killed anyone who got in their way on the spot. How did they sneak past us? They must have traveled by night. They were well prepared. That doesn't sound good. Maybe we shouldn't pursue them. No way. They won't get away that easily. <laughs> wow. Okay. Um, a lot of different characters here. Well, help. We'll, we'll help you. A few good archers can go a long way in any battle. I got five archers. In a question mark. Sharpshooter from Flatland shoots. 430 shield. Special shield. Boots. And a call of the wild. What is this? This ability will uh, be available later in gameplay. All right, that's cool. I'm down with that. All right. Uh oh. I see a double dagger James Franco down here from uh, Spring Breakers. Ah, look at that. Sure enough. Uh, hey, you bunch of pitiful weaklings. Empty your pockets. Oh no, it's crooked eye Sam. Looks like he's been released from prison again. Keep calm. Even a whole gang of robbers can't defeat us. To arms! You want to do this the hard way? He he he. This should be interesting. That's how I'm going to read the laugh. He he he. Alright, happy night. Here we go. Cunning halfway. Ha cunning highway robber drops coins after death. Whoop. Two stars. Does not shun any work. No special abilities, just like me. He's just a peon. Their peons are a little different than my peons. His peon is brown haired. The archers attack at a distance. The target is far away. Blah, blah, blah. All right. Got it. Not a problem. I got this. Die, Wolfie. All right. They're bringing it. They're bringing the pain. I've got this. Oh, so my ranged warrior has a melee attack when everything gets close and up, up personal, so. That's cool. So here I go. I'm going to go kill James Franco with his corn rolls and his little knifers. All right. All right. So where, where should I? Okay. So you're not giving me any tips any further. Okay. So I've got to decide. Do I attack guy close to me? Or do I do a ranged attack? I'm going to close, close attack that wolf there. I think my peon. Oh, he totally took out James Franco. Not a problem. Uh, walked there. Collected some gold. He dropped his doubloons. Oh, well, that was maybe a little bit too easy. Flawless victory. Didn't even get hurt, apparently. So, uh, sweet. All right, say night. All right. Oh, we got a little guy down here. He seems to be uh, attached to a pole. So, let's see what he has to say. You discover, you discover a captive in the bandits' camp. Phew, I thought those bandits were going to kill me. Wait a minute. You're Nolan from the West Village. I've heard about your father. They say he was a good soldier. Yes, my father taught me a thing or two. Although I often skipped out on his training sessions to go listen to the Elder's Legends. You know, I used to be a pretty good shot until I got an arrow in the knee. I think I can teach your archers a useful trick. Archers have learned a new ability. Raid, shot, inflicts increased damage to the target. Check. Alright, here we go. This guy looks like a burly man. Whoa, listen to all that extra metal rattling. We could easily resell it. Let's go, guys. Strip these numbskulls of everything they don't need. Your arrogance is exceeded only by the length of your beard. What beard joke? Beard jab. Let me shorten it for you, so it doesn't get in the way. Alright, so here we are in the battlefield again. Uh, this guy, Smithy. Smithy has a firm hand and a magic hammer. Uh, so he's actually got a power here. Lightning hammer and inflicts damp magic. 
damage by lightning to the enemy at a distance. So he's going to do a little bit of range attacking here. So three stars, and there's only one in his squad. Three, three, one. Active Shot of Fury. So my, <clears throat> I have now have my special abilities activated. I have a, uh, so I guess you have to activate it there. And so we want me to attack this peon up here. Can do. Ooh, pretty. I like it. I like it a lot. All right, uh, next move. You're up. I'm going to go here. You notice uh, in some strategy turn-based games, you can you can uh, trade off uh, for distance for other things. Uh, you apparently cannot go outside the grids here. So this is the closest grid, but I still have more movements left if I do that. And a little further. Uh, so I could actually move here, and then it would still give me an option for moving to my... Uh, to my end there but before I do that I want to make sure that I shoot and murder Mr. Smith over here because I don't want him coming after me uh, these guys are all within range now can you hit him with my pitchfork my peons peon versus peon all right I got lots of archers and I'm going to continue to attack Smitty up here because I don't want him to come get me uh, it looks like he's going to try to traverse around the outside and uh, flank me in the meantime, I'm going to attack this guy and try to get that whole squad out there. I went with the one squad instead of the two squad because I thought, well, you know, they can't inflict any damage if they're dead. Sounds stupid, I know, but it's a strategy game and that's my strategy. Oh, close up knife shot. All right, so once again, I'm going to keep concentrating and trying to take out the lower guys first because even though uh, their attack may not be much... Uh, they can be a nuisance, so I'm going to get rid of those guys. So now it's just me and Smitty, and uh oh, he's striking me down. He, I've lost one of my squad. Okay, so am I ready with this? This is charged up. Did I just activate or deactivate it? Oh, I activated it. I did. I activated it. He's out. Smitty's gone. All right, lost a few. Lost an archer. Lost a peon, and trophies. Da 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 da. Experience. I'm still level one. So. Uh, leveling up is, uh, you, know, well, you know, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Oh, thank you. Uh, my, my group says that I'm doing good. Let's see. How's this guy talk? Are you from the Rob Village? We saw carts carrying all kinds of goods with our very old eyes. These bandits are well armed and organized. Their leader is a mercenary, a stud warrior. Carts, mercenaries, it's no wonder they took us by surprise. They prepared well in advance. Yes, I think we can track them down. There is a path through the forest. We will show you the way. Come on now, I got two knives. Look, come on, let's knives. The trackers join you. So now I have uh, archers, peons, and trackers. So, oh, I meant to click and see more about him, but I didn't do it. All right. This guy looks kind of snooty. He's kind of like uppity up. They're coming after us to get their precious stuff back. He looks like a knight who is uh, maybe in, in disarray. Maybe he's a little bit poor knight. He's a poor knight. The commander has heard rumors that a bunch of peasants is on our trails. Fools, we will destroy you. Gets kind of evil there. So your leader thinks that he can be... Oh, that's not right. That's not the right voice. So your leader thinks that he can be stopped by a handful of unskilled archers. If we can't take you by skill... We'll take you by numbers. Sad droid. Became a robber after barely learning how to shoot. Shoots. Sometimes misses. Just like me. No special powers. Let's go. Vagrant Valiant. All right. All right. Here's my double knifers. He's on his way. Deployed him. No special firing. Okay. Uh, get my peon up here. All right. Got my special archers up here. Let's see. Uh, everybody seems to be pretty well suited. I'm going to get hit with a... I'm just going to hit this guy. No real strategy to that. Just had to pick somebody. Might as well be this guy. Ooh. All right. I'm not used to getting hit back. I don't like it. I don't like it. You missed. Ooh. All right. These guys are going to murderize my archers if I'm not careful. All right. Let's get in here. All right. Oh, what did you hit me for? All right. Be on. Oh, Peon oh, can't, can't quite reach him, but I want to block you guys so that you can't get past me. Well, it doesn't matter. they got arrows, so I guess melee is not really a problem here. So, once again, I'm going to go with the lower numbers and see if I can... Oh, so he's going to move. Huh, I got gotcha. you. 
Sorry, my bad. And still recharging on my magic arrows. I was able to push these guys back a little bit, but I don't know if that's really going to do me any good. Uh, they seem to like it. They seem to like it. All right. There we go. Man, my, this guy looks like he needs a nap, though, doesn't he? Look at that. Double knifer needs a nap. No! Why? All right. Maybe I can at least get one of these squads out. Man, stabbing the guy in the back. That's not nice. Oh, what is it? Did you see that shot? He's like, he's like facing this way, but he shot upward. Weird. All right, I'm going to try to come down here and trap this guy in a world of hurt. All right, and this guy. Oh, I should have really went for the onesor, huh? Why did I do that? All right, I'll attack him with my archer and then. Go ahead and get him out of here. One less group hitting me. No good, he missed. You know, they said they miss sometimes, and they weren't kidding, but a fourth of the time it seems these guys are missing. Um... I'm going to take this squad out. That'll work. All right. And take this squad out, too. And now I'm going to fight the one squad. The squad of three. The squad of two. Two squad. All right. Do I ever... Uh-oh. You know what? My peon's going to be... Uh, he's going to be blocked. So I'm going to have to walk on the outside here. I didn't think those obstacles would come into play, but they are coming into play. They're screwing up my strategy. Strategizing. All right, there we go. All right, so uh, we lost a peon. No big deal, four points. Still get to collect 136 gold. Hey, I'm level two. When did that happen? It's a pretty good. Uh, it's pretty good. All right, so I'm, I'm up, up a level. Uh, gained, uh, gained, I get to choose from my training here. Do you want to go attack or endurance? So far, my attacks have been pretty strong. I'm losing gold. So I'm going to go with endurance. All right, so let's move on to the next level. There's a little bit of music coming down out of here. Oh, I forget. I haven't done Robin in so long. A tavern is a good place to hire some new warriors. I don't know what's making. Okay. We gladly join you for a good salary and a mug of fruit ale. That's not how I did the peons while I go. I have to really go back and... Perhaps we will hire some of you. A small force would not be enough to defeat the bandits. All right, so uh, I can increase my squad sizes, and I got to choose: do I want uh, more of these guys or more of these guys, peons or archers? Um, kind of, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a range guy. I'm gonna buy one of those. Uh, stuff enough for that too. So I'm gonna put that. And uh, should I spend all my gold now? Now let's let's save a little bit. Might, maybe something else we're gonna be shopping for. I can always come back, right? We'll find out in a minute. Uh, here's your money. All right. Uh oh. Here we're going against Black Bart. Apparently. Oh, he's got a he's got an eye patch on. Commander Frog knows that it is it was you who ambushed his men, and he's offering a mighty high reward for your heads. Commander who? His men have cleaned out our dirty villages. If you haven't noticed. The bandit leader, he must have been scared out of his wits if he sent you after us. The commander doesn't have time to waste on a bunch of petty villages. We've been paid in gold to track you down. The rest of the bounty will be paid in exchange for your heads. No head. I'm kind of attached to it. Experienced robber seeks out a weak victim fires. And his special power. Whistle. <laughs> Inspired bandits. Inspires bandits by increasing damage they deal. So he will call forth the dogs of war. All right. So, Double Dagger Man, come on. Get into range. We need to kill this guy. Oh, James Franco's got you. Look out. All right. Well, this is, this is the biggest squad I've had to go against. Maybe I should have bought some more uh, peons. Can I split those up into, like, multiple groups? Does my squad have to be all one giant squad? Was that an option? Did I miss? Uh, oh, I just now noticing these down here, too. What is this? Uh, I just took a break. Is that what I just did? Does that mean I lost a turn? I don't know. Shield. What does that cost me? Yes, it does. It costs a turn, just like you would think. It's turn base. So I can... Uh, so I'm probably getting a buff for uh, choosing my... 
uh, choosing my time there. I wonder if that heals. Hmm, I don't know. I'm gonna do some more research on that. I'm sure you probably know people. Okay, what, 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 what? Come on, pitchfork guy. Let's go. Let's go take the hay out. Ma ha ha ha. All right. Double knifer. Murf. All right, these guys are getting murderized. Hey, you're doing pretty good, though. Two knives versus two knives. This is more like a cutlass. This is kind of a little bit of a curved kind of sword there. Uh, hmm, I'm in big trouble anyway you look at it. All right. Go stab this wolf a couple of times with my pitchy fork. Let's see if we can at least get some of these squads out. I'm going to have to use a little bit of strategy here. Use this guy before he gets killed because he's about to go down, I believe. Uh, I'm losing some archers there, too. This is not good. This is not. This has been a poor battle for me. Let's get rid of that wolf. Got rid of him. Uh, go ahead and stab this wolf. Get him off of my archers. Oh, wow. Oh, crap. I forgot about the whistle. Now he's inspired everyone with his great whistling. All right. Okay, me and Franco, we're, we're fighting. Uh, oh, and there goes my dude. Thanks a lot, Franco. All right, let's see if we can get out. Maybe I should have went against... I should have killed this guy first. But he's probably got a lot of health. He was a three-star guy, so... <sighs> okay, let's see... If I killed his troops, who have nobody to inspire... Did you see that arrow? It was, like, totally backwards. What was that all about? Okay, let's get rid of Franco. He's gone. Okay, maybe I can kill this wolf up here. Get rid of him. Oh, not quite. Alright, so... Uh, taking quite the bit of damage to my archers. But hopefully my farmers will save me in the end. I also see some gold over here I'm, I'm looking forward to getting. Still, that those wolves are doing pretty good against my guy here. This is getting serious, yo. This is not good. This is totally serious. I'm not gonna hide in these bushes. Till this is over. There we go. Makes me feel bad though that those little wolves cry and yip like that. That's makes me feel a little bit bad. Looks like I'm gonna win this, but at great cost. Great cost to my warriors. All right. About got him. There we go. We got him. Oh, was I supposed to go get that uh, crate before I murdered them? Uh, I have a feeling that I probably should have. Feeling like that might have been part of my strategy. And you can tell, lost a pretty good bit of men in that battle. Didn't get nearly as much gold. Pretty good bit of experience. I'm almost level three. Sad night. All right. Uh, oh, didn't I? Okay, this is a new guy. But I've already fought one guy. Okay, whatever. I've already fought this guy, kind of, sort of. These curse trackers ruin our entire business. They lead merchants down secret paths. What's a robber to do but clean out a simpleton like you? Nothing personal, friend. A job's a job. Look at my corn rolls. Took me two hours. My girlfriend hates me. All right. My girl hates, my girlfriend hates me. All right, let's see here. Okay, so the robbers, you know, they got some, they got some archers and some. Uh, they're gonna. Oh, he's, he's stabbing me there. Don't, don't do that, man. All right, so can't quite reach him there. Gonna go down about a block away, so he at least has to walk and get me before he can get me, get me. Oh, and what's my strategy here? This this time there there is no gold or anything this time, so. We're gonna do uh, go go straight in. Gonna go straight in for this. And attack, attack, attack. Alright. It's gonna be down to archers, looks like, because Mr. Stabby McGee is about to go down. Uh oh. Uh oh oh boy, he really he came straight for the goods, didn't he? All right. Wow, he is highly... Oh, you know what? I'm not even using my magic arrows. Thank goodness he missed. No, nope. landed that one. I may be in trouble here, people. All right. I hear stabbed archers. All right, all right. There we go. Stabby, stabby, stabby. I'm going to take him out. 
Now this time I'm going to use magic missile. Uh, see if I can take these guys out. Boom. Uh, pretty good hit. Down to one squad member. And I think I'm about to lose my guy here. Oh, he's still around. He's still kicking. Maybe he can take out that squad. Good job. All right, I'm going to pick this gold up while I'm here. Don't want to forget and lose that. Get myself into position. Uh, magic missile not ready. And boom. Attack this guy up here near this. What do you suppose is in that stew up there? You suppose it's rabbit stew? Could be rabbit stew. Could be skunk stew. All right. There we go. Could be my head. We will boil your head. In our cauldron of head boiling. All right. Magic missile not ready still, so... Here we go. Here's nothing. Here we go. Uh, I wonder if my guy come over here and take out that... That axe out of that stump and really go to town. You know, it was looking bad at first, but I think... I think I'm going to pull this off. At great cost, but I think I'm going to get this. All right. So we're at first. Where are you going? Where are you going there? Where are you going? There you go. There you go. Uh, well, I haven't moved my archer at all. Is there any advantage to that, I wonder? I wonder if being, uh, like, on a horizontal path of these guys would make it any better, like, more effective, or if, or if that even matters. I'm going to find out. Is it mostly a defensive move, or is it anything at all for our offensive? All right, lost some people. That's cool. Got some money. Let's go. All right. Uh, oh, I, I I leveled up. Endurance is what I picked last time. Knowledge. I'm going over a little knowledge this time. Because knowing is half the battle. Oh, you know what? I never even went back here and attacked this guy. Interesting. Uh, buh, 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 buh. All right, so I'm kind of at a stopping point here. And I will be back in just a bit for some more Braveland. You've been watching Brian play it poorly.